Hey everybody. Here we have another computer to clean out today. This is our neighbor's machine and the power supply has some issues. Probably needs a new capacitor on the 5 volt standby rail like many of the best tech um, 250-12Zs need. You can see this thing is pretty dang filthy. It'd be the filthiest one I've dealt with in a while, so. <laughs> Let's see what we have here. Inside don't look too awful bad. There's a little bit of dust in the door, in the side panel. But it seems like most of the filth is up there in the power supply. The um, CPU cooler. There is some build up in there, but it's not terrible. So, anyways, let's clean her out. Okay, let's have a look. Well, blow out this panel down here first. Alrighty. Anyways, looks a lot better than it did. Not that it was all that bad to begin with. I've seen much worse. It's a basic end machine, nothing too fancy. I do see a couple of caps that are bulging just a little bit there on the motherboard. Typical for the Kimicons. Nothing surprising. Those shouldn't be causing too much any problems though. I know there is um, a capacitor inside the power supply that needs attention. Needs replacing. It's the little capacitor that's right next to the um, secondary heatsink that's in charge of the 5 volt standby rail. Um, now, with these best tech power supplies, <clears throat> I have tons of videos up of these things. Now, the ones that come in the e machines computers, the, um, the best tech ATX 2512E model, the 250 watt 12E model is the one that is um, flawed in design. Has a two transistor 5 volt standby rail with no protection circuitry for over voltage, over current, you know, short circuit, things like that. Um, now the um, 312E that's in the e-machine just does actually have 
a decent 5 volt standby rail. Um, you know, IC controlled with protections. Same goes for the 250-12Z that you commonly find in HPs and compacts. Now this is a this is a machine I built myself out of um, this random parts laying around. So the power slide did come from HP sometime back when. Um, it's been in there for I don't know three four years maybe. Been there for a while. Anyways, does look a lot better than it did. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.